Mwanga Emakaya and welcome to another exciting episode of my journey. La pose kulumisa na gabandi ne banvu la benda umetlu we mparatini. Kona la kuruf top mkomazi. Na msa njeba fetu, sisi mkomazi in one of the topest kasi kamshusho. Sita ukulumisa na nukolo mkwe na lutate sinya tele so mge nela Miss South Africa 2020. Right now, asisi chwe, sitfole gabandi nge chini ya nukolo. At the Snowcoders place, it's where we ate. Let's get right to it. Check this out. Mara Uti Vanjanga is no monocola set. He Jablega Kulusis Kakulu, Sang Jablis, I was it. Who says a small less easily? Let's talk on Bissau and Gumdwana and Obatan, who sits in Van and Obatan. Mele Asali at Petsegasi at the Navy Bushabaki. A hambe to fish when Dakila said, and I'm Jabli like a cool, and I sang a tobega. I'm Nakolo Pell Mugwena. I am 21 years of age. I am currently studying media practices at Boston Media House. I am from Pumalanga, Gamfusha. I entered Miss South Africa because I stand firmly for young girls and young women to stand for what they believe in. It's not only a pretty face that makes a woman stand out from the crowd. Her personality, confidence and the charm that counts the most. Miss South Africa pageant. Yes, it is my first time entering Miss South Africa. Um, but I've entered Miss Talakot back in 2014. That's where I got the taste of entering pageant. So what inspired you to enter? Watching the Miss South Africa pageant when I was young, um, I decided to enter for Miss South Africa 2020 because the powerful women that I've watched from the pageants, they inspired me and motivated me and I believe that I am a strong woman also. I am capable to do the pageant also. What have you done so far to shortlist it? I've been on my social media platforms and been doing live videos so that people can get to know me and see what I do on my daily basis live. What is your biggest achievement up to date? My biggest achievement is completing my matric because without education I wouldn't be here. Miss South Africa needs to have grade 12 actually so I decided to end my school in grade 12 so that I can be able to enter the pageant. I have talent of dancing and singing. I do that every day and I don't get tired of it. Who do you look up to day to day life? Um, I look up to my mom because she's the one who raised me and I know she's a powerful woman and one day I wish to be a wonderful woman like her and have kids so that I can raise them like my what mom What kind did. of support are you looking for from your community? The support that I need from my community is prayers and they can um, catch me on or they can get hold of me on my social media platforms. Facebook, I am Pearl Mugwena. And Instagram, I am Pearly Gates, and Twitter, I am Pearly Gates. Uh, I'm going to go to the only what is needed is support. I'm going to support the based on how we interact personality wise mina is just fine and lengi ne lengi boni lenga yebuti mina is a connect jai vaso itu so in the less connect is as yes na kuto spawn lenga cool sugel yebuti um I'm supporting her culture, and I wish her all the best throughout her journey in this Miss SA. Blessed is the hand that is giving than the one that is receiving. Jamo bani bona. No kolo nem gano ake. They are preparing to go and donate my food passe. As it's a good thing for her, some men now will say, "Bona, what's going to go on the buyer corner?" I 
Sento was doing it drop center where we are about to meet Sesnom Vula Mbata, one of the founders of the drop center. If you'd like to be featured on one of our show, leave us your contact details on our Facebook page, Rooftop Nkomazi or email us at rooftopnkomazi at gmail.com. Don't forget to follow us and subscribe on our YouTube channel. We are Rooftop Nkomazi. Nelishwage, jengo banate kutilogunga peli kuyashola. Banamu mtlakpela lana. Asipipes bambane futi ngalikutago.